Welcome back to my channel. My name is Janelle Samora and this is Scent Talk from my closet, the fragrance closet. On this channel, we go over all things fragrance. We cover niche perfume houses. We go over layering combos. We talk about dupes and clones of original fragrances, highlight indie perfume brands on the channel, all things fragrance. If that's something you're interested in, go ahead and continue watching. Consider hitting that subscription button and the bell so you'll be notified to new videos. Um, if it's your first time on the channel, I do like to focus on one perfume house or brand um, at a time or topic. And this week we are focusing on Poesy. They are an indie perfume brand, 100% handmade products. They use only the highest type of ingredients in, in these fragrances. They're vegan, cruelty free, uh, paraben free, phthalate free. Um, just really, really good for your skin. I haven't had any issues. They're heavily concentrated on the oils. Um, some of the fragrances that are resinous as well, you have to shake them a little bit. They are heavily, heavily uh, oil-based. So that's the fragrance house itself. Um, I <laughs> House. <laughs> um, I've been having it such a good time with this house. It really, really unique scents put together just so creatively they have little backstories to each of the fragrances and today's is no different it is called madar if you want to go on the site poesy.com and check it out it every single one has a little excerpt you know before talking about placing the fragrance you know like where where are you with this or where are they a little storyline so for madar here i'm just I'm pretty excited to go through this, definitely. Um, I have not met a rice note that agrees with my skin. My skin chemistry, for whatever reason, um, the only fragrance that I can tolerate it so far in is by Killian, and it is called Moonlight in Heaven. It has a mango note, it has a sticky rice note as well, um, and, and I can handle that. I really do enjoy that kind of rice water toned fragrance. And um, I've tried others and it hasn't exactly gone too well. So I have tried others. It hasn't gone too well. Oh, I'm back. I thought that Charlie was trying to open the door. And not that I didn't want you guys to see Charlie because, you know, Charlie's amazing. Um, but I really thought it was Charlie. <laughs> it was my husband with this. Oh goodness and I'm over here holding the door like oh, just holding it so Charlie won't bust in through the door while I'm trying to get my you know conversation on about rice notes and whatnot <laughs> cheers everybody cheers we are having some delicious wine it is my mother's birthday today she's turning 81 years old and I'm extra excited to do this review because not only is it my girlfriend's favorite the one that suggested poesy fragrances to me um it 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 turned out to be one of my mother's favorites oh she said that this scent is very nostalgic to her she's like i've smelled this before so we're probably going to spend uh some time because i mean i've been gone all day so we're probably going to spend some time this afternoon or this evening and kind of talk about you know what what is this reminding her of and and you know and i don't have this memory but she apparently does um so let's talk about madar it is and let's not spill my wine <laughs> it is um one of the most creamiest rice note fragrances. Um, I just I just have to go out and say that they have really, really captivated me with this and my mother as well. And that means so, so much to me. This is definitely on the list now for me to gift to her for Christmas for certain. Because from here on out, nobody gets things just because. And it's too late to give it to her for her birthday. <laughs> Turning 81 today, my mother. All right, so we have notes of rice pudding, orange flower water. We have saffron, cinnamon, cardamom, dried rose petals, and sugared pistachios. Honestly, I get a lot of creaminess from this fragrance. I was so worried about these rose petals. Um, excuse me. Man, can I talk to my friends about fragrances today? <laughs> like, I just got like interruptions left and right. Settle down. Settle down, people. <sighs> I don't get a prominent rose note in this fragrance. I was 
I was low-key, borderline, you know, worried about that. Rose can turn very, very screechy on my skin. Um, in fact, have we tried a rose oud from here, a rose mahogany wood type fragrance, and it was really smooth as well. So my conclusion so far, being this the second one with rose in it, is that Poesy... Um, Posey's rose is very nice and round very you know it presents itself in a in a smooth manner so you know it does not stick out it's not sharp and it's not headache inducing so um, I did put this on my hand right here because I no longer have it on my skin um, any longer this went a good seven uh, pretty much eight hours or so of wear with this Madar. Um, if I had the roller ball you know I would probably roll to my heart's content and it would last all day long or if I had also placed it in a sprayer form but I was I was really a little worried about this fragrance because of the rose because I've not been successful yet uh, other than Moonlight in Heaven by Killian um, with the rice notes. I'm like ooh, what if you know my skin does something to the rice notes it just turns it um, like very damp smelling and very I mean just not appealing to me to my senses it's not enjoyable this was very enjoyable you can smell the cinnamon in here with this rice pudding and it is so creamy and the cinnamon is not one that like whoa you, you know heavy heavy cinnamon it's a very light light covering or dusting of cinnamon on top you know um it is reminding me of agua de horchata which is a uh, rice water uh sweet and it's got some cinnamon in there as well I'll put a picture here for you guys um really delicious drink uh, we got going on down here it's a water you know um but um it is creamy basmati rice pudding which i've not had rice pudding uh you know i don't eat rice pudding but that's what it's smelling like to me uh which is the drink the agua de horchata oh for certain um oh the saffron in here i want to say is what gave this some nice umph throughout the day it's just you know in and out very very nice i get I get such a comforting feeling from this. I get a very, you know, I'm pink. This is pinky. You're drinking your drink with a pinky up type feel. I mean, it's just, you know, you're, you're, you're browsing, you're window shopping. Um, you know, definitely shopping is included with this. <laughs> you have that nice, you know, either you're eating the pudding or you're drinking that drink and you're walking window shopping and it's a beautiful, cool day. I'm um, just so comforting. This is a comforting scent here by the House of Poise. Um, you know, it just even just like perfect happiness to me was very zen, very comforting, um, you know, but fresh at the same time. Here too, we have a little bit of freshness maybe coming from the orange flower water. I don't know, you could smell everything. You could smell the sugared pistachios. You could smell the rice putting um you know the the cinnamon the cardamom in here is not crazy apparent or strong like it is in some other fragrances cardamom to me um it just gives me a very masculine tone the cardamom in for in other fragrances depending on what they how they structure it or what they combine it with um but and i was afraid also that's why i didn't spray it because i was like oh that's gonna be a little a little much and it wasn't. It was so, so nice. This is nice. I really enjoyed this. This is pastries, tea, you know, <laughs> really, really enjoyable. I'm so excited that my mom absolutely loved this. And I cannot wait to find out what, what memory it's conjuring up for her and uh, present it to her at Christmas. Because this is the one I've been exploring and experimenting with the fragrances and showing them to her. And she really loved um the perfect happiness she really really loved it on me but she did not like the grassy tone she said it had um up close so i was like oh <laughs> i can't give that to her because she's probably not going to enjoy it being close on her person she just enjoyed it in the atmosphere um you know in the siage but this right here she is loving it and i am loving it so we're just gonna have a great time with this <laughs> madar yes thank you so much for introducing me to this house um uh, beth and thank you for sharing your 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 loves with me i am absolutely enjoying them so so much um this one here is our 
uh, what we have cardigan and whisper your bitter things left to try out um whisper your bitter things to me smelled very coffee vibes roasted coffee beans it was giving nice also i actually wouldn't mind wearing it with madar <laughs> like throw some coffee in there in the mix um but we'll see we'll see what i what i pair that with i don't feel like it's something i'd want to wear on its own i will more than likely pair it with a lotion or some or something for this one i just did straight up um what is the word uh, unscented lotion but now i'm like ooh, i want to do maybe possibly bonfire bash by bath and body works or get something uh like twice as nice as well from house of glory like i want to do something uh give it a little extra sweetness to this fragrance it's already sweet oh but it's um uh, man it's really nice <laughs> I really enjoyed this. I really did. This is another full bottle worthy, um, and I'll and I'll reserve that for my mom. I'll enjoy it, you know, when she's when she's wearing it, and probably sneak some in for myself for days when I need comfort. This is a comforting fragrance. All right, we have a couple more. Thank you so much for tuning in to the review, and um, I hope that if you do order this or try these out, that you include Madar in your little sample kit because it is nice i am enjoying this so so far recap recap we have versailles for certain full bottle and we have perfect happiness as well very comforting enjoying coconut you know fragrance um just mm, mouth watering and now we have madar for certain for certain Ooh, cardigan and whisper your bitter things we're we'll We'll get through those. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. You have a blessed rest of your day, your night, or your evening, and you stay safe.